Hello everyone, today we're going to take a look at WordPress 4.5 uh, release candidate 1 uh, so we can see some of the new features that are coming up in WordPress 4.5 and so I can see here I am on my test site and I'm running uh, WordPress 4.5 release candidate 1 with the 2016 team. Let's see some of the new features. So most of the features are under the hood so we don't really see them but um, the ones that we do see are, for example, the responsive preview on the customizer. So now if we come here to customizer, now we have these three icons here, these three buttons that will basically um, change the resolution of the preview. So you can see how it will look, for example, in a tablet mode or in phone mode. So so we go back to desktop, tablet, and phone. So, so it's pretty neat. So you can preview how your team looks in different devices right here from the uh, customizer. Another new feature is the team logo support. So they added the logo support so we can upload a, a logo here now for the team that do support it which is, will be pretty easy to implement. But then if you want to change your logo, you're going to come here to site identity. And now we have this logo. And here we can upload a new one. So let's quick uh, upload this one, WordPress. Here we can crop it. And there we have it. Now is on the website live. So we say publish. Actually we can get rid of the title. And there you go. And here you can change the tagline. Um, and also that's another new feature that they added. As you can see as I update here, it updates over here. It's called selective refresh. So it's basically it's listening for all the changes on the on the customizer and updating the preview. So we can say that. So now we have go to our website that we have the new logo and the new tagline. Okay, so let's move on. Another new feature is um, inline link editing. So um, as prior, let's add a pause inline link so before um this this is kind of like a minor tweak to the ui that they made so uh let's type some text and if you wanted to link this word the text is just selected and you click link and now this inline is right here so this is the new look Be the prior where it was just like this to where you add this light box um, that you can add this um, the, the URL and the text and add the link and the new way is the inline so it's pretty quick we just add the link here and that's it and then the link is there but if you needed to for example um, when somebody clicks here, you wanted to open a new window, you will have to hit the options and select the adding a new tab. Okay, so let's move on. The another uh, feature is the new HR tag. They are a shortcut. So if you want to add a line in between the text, um, simply um, add three dashes and hit enter. And as you can see now we have a line that will go across so you can separate some text um, from each other. And that last feature that I wanted to show you is the Twitter moments. So Twitter have these uh, moments where you can follow. Um, so now we, we can embed these moments pretty easily. For example, we should click on this one, on this moment, and we just grab the URL um let's delete this and we just paste it and as you can see it loads the moment 
and with all this moment content and so it makes it pretty easy to to uh, embed moments as you can see here okay so these are some of the new features that are coming up on WordPress 4.5 I hope you like the video until the next one